So before we had robots, we were waking up about 4.30 every morning to start milking cows. And one of the wonderful things about robots is that it has allowed us to be a little bit more flexible. We actually don't start chores till about 7.30 now. We have a little bit more time to actually spend taking care of them rather than just trying to get through chores every day. The amazing thing about having robots in the barn is that we are able to access so much data about each and every one of our cows. We're able to measure things like their eating habits, their rumination, which is when they're chewing their cud and they're digesting their food. We're able to see their activity, which lets us know if they're in heat. It also lets us know when a cow is not feeling well. So we're able to have a lot of signals to care for our animals through the data that we are accessing through the robots. The robot knows who each individual cow is because of the collars that they're wearing. So each cow actually wears a collar that is similar to a Fitbit. That collar actually communicates with the robot and that's how the robot knows who it is. How the robot actually attaches to the cow is we have a laser that is on the robot. It's called laser. So it scans the teeth ends to give them a mapping of the udder for the cow. When the cow is done being milked, the milk will go into a collection jar in the robot where it's weighed and measured. My favorite thing about milking with robots would have to be the flexibility. In our old system, we were very much tied to a very specific time of day or night. In this robotic milking system, because the cows are being milked at their leisure through the night, through the day, all the time, what we're able to do is shift things around a little bit if we need to so that we can go to a play date with the baby. Uh, we can have Christmas dinner maybe at four o'clock instead of nine o'clock at night.